Nama Hari Raya. Now Chelsea and Barcelona have come and gone. By the time you're watching this particular package, what's football got to do with what we're about to show you? Absolutely nothing. I'm just messing with you. I thought I'd just send your brain to the five corners of the universe and then back again. Bajum Layu, private jet, football, just messing with you. Let me surmise and clear the air as to why we're here today. West Star Group has kindly invited Hello On2 to follow them on your CSR initiative in Kota Baru, Klantan. And on top of that, we're granted an exclusive interview with the head honchos, the people behind West Star Group. So don't go anywhere. I'm Terence Das. That's a 727, a very cool private jet. And this is a very serious hot happening package. Welcome aboard the 727, now owned by Westar, and it's amazing to know the fact that this plane was previously owned by Donald Trump himself. The plane actually came complete with its own pilot, Mr. Mike Donovan, and he's one of the pilots that still flies the plane till this very day. When Group Managing Director Tan Sri Said Azman Said Ibrahim laid the foundations for the Westar Group in 2003, he had a sturdy vision to create an organization that was successful not just within Malaysia, but also regionally and internationally. Less than a decade later, the West Star Group is well on its way of achieving just that. Having begun as a single company purveying luxury cars in 2003, West Star has grown rapidly into a group comprising eight thriving corporations. Led strongly by two of its flagship corporations, West Star Aviation Services, Cindy Van Brahad, which provides general and oil and gas aviation services, and Westar Maxis distributors, distributors of the highly popular and versatile Westar Maxis commercial vans. I'm psyched to be on board the 727 with me now and start this as myself. Thank you, Dansri, for the opportunity Thank you. to fly on board the vessel with you. Uh -huh. and, uh, and this interview is surreal, really. We've <laughs> never had an interview so far up above sea level. And recently, taken the business Well, it's, it's always been in our plan to go global. Yeah. And uh, well, we're lucky we won the uh, Talu Oil contract. It was an, they called for an international tender. We participated and we were bidding against uh, uh, international companies, you know, like Brist Bristol, Canadian Helicopter and whatnot. And well, uh, I'm very glad we won the contract. Well, uh, currently there's a great, huge uh, shortage in, fact, uh, in getting uh, pilots, helicopter pilots and helicopter engineers. Uh, in Westa, we 70% of our engineers and pilots are locals and 30% uh, are expatriates. Well, we hope to overcome this, uh, this problem in the next two years or so. Currently, we are working with Mara. You know, uh, for Mara to sponsor the first batch of 32 uh, local students to be trained as offshore pilots in America, where we will guarantee them uh, jobs as pilots, co-pilots at least. The Westar Group has further business interests in the passenger car, luxury car, construction and defence and engineering sectors. Westar Aviation Services has already made its regional presence strongly felt having become the largest provider of oil and gas aviation services in the Southeast Asian region in 2011. Growth of the uh, rotowing aviation industry, especially for offshore, is very much dependent on the growth of the oil company. And the oil companies are growing uh, quite at a fast pace. And it is, real, it is a challenge for us to try to keep up the pace. Because why I say it is a challenge? First of all, you need, you need to have airframes and sec, uh, subsequently you need to have pilots, you need to have crews and all these are in high demand all over the place. So you have got to put in a kind of plan and strategy to make sure to entice them to work for Westar. It is well poised to expand aggressively in the coming years. 
West Star Maxis after signing a joint venture with the Shanghai Automotive Industry Corporation, SAIC, in 2010, holds the sole West Star Maxis van distribution rights for the entire Asia-Pacific region and will be launching the vehicle in Indonesia and Thailand in 2013, marking an important global milestone for the company. Yeah, Westar's uh, automotive division comprises of uh, dealership of Honda. We've been a uh, Honda dealer for the last 11 years. And uh, of course, the, the main core business of uh, Westar Automotive is the van, which is uh, Westar Maxxis. I think it's a very good business here for Westar Aviation uh, Services, uh, starting the business in Kota Baru, Kelantan, because the business in Kota Baru is booming up and uh, increasing by year by year. Having been built and nurtured around the strong pillars of quality, innovation, reliability and safety, the Westar Group has come a long way and is set to go forward even further. I've got a smile a mile long after that 41-minute flight on board a 727. Check it out, there are only 10 planes like it in the world today and it was truly an amazing experience. We'd like to thank the West Star Group for giving us this very special opportunity to be on board the flight, to interview Tan Sri as well as to be a part of the CSR initiative. I'm Terence Das. it's truly been a happy day for me here today, and I wish you all the happiness in the world as well. I'm sending you back to the studio for Hello On Too.